Hi, you guys. Thank you so much for being here with me, Brandy at Back to One. We're gonna do a little bit different today. I am going to uh, pull some messages for the element. Do you know what your element is? I'm an air element with a mixture of water element. Um, we are so much more than our sun signs and um, like, I love windy days, like a tornado it birthed me into the world. Um, and then, um, you know, some people are earth elements, so they, they love nature, like they go hiking and stuff. And then there's um, the fire energies, and they're like the most spontaneous um fires that you can contain okay and then there's um the water energy those people like love love water like water therapy is like super good for them but i wanted to go and see what kind of messages we could get for the elements and i am going to start with the air signs so this is gemini's libra's and aquarius's so let's go ahead and see what kind of messages um, the collective of back to one for the air elements we're gonna start with Gemini what affirmation do Gemini Libra and Aquarius this need from this beautiful deck what kind of affirmations do we need they find this video this is a timeless if you find this, that's when you're supposed to see it. I've asked to uh, share a message with you with my beautiful blessed ability. So uh, thank you so much for being here. Let's go ahead and see. So, affirmation for the air elements for the collective back to one. When they find this video. So Gemini. Thank you. Gemini. Ooh, forgiveness as a bonus card. Let's shuffle and see what else we can get. So uh, the forgiveness card says, congratulations, you've been given one of the most powerful superpowers there is, and that is forgiveness. Um, the point is that you suddenly have the ability to forgive people for their flaws, their bad days, their unkind moments and mistakes. And the best thing about forgiveness is that you can apply it to yourself. Have fun and welding in your new power. But remember, with great forgiveness comes great inner peace. Okay, is there an affirmation for the Gemini's for the air? Woo! To go with forgiveness for the Gemini's. I find this video. Wow, another bonus card. Okay, so maybe with forgive when you do this forgiveness, maybe that could be a block for you. Okay, maybe with this forgiveness, uh, they're letting you know like you're manifesting. So this is a bonus card too. So I'm gonna shuffle another one. But this says, if you could have anything you wanted, what would it be? Get Pacific and get greedy. You're holding the magic wand and you can courage up anything. So if it could be when you declare your wishes out loud that you're actually casting spells for your dreams to come true, or is it that it's the very practical sense the more people you speak about your desires the more folks there are that know what you want and might be able to have the means to help you make them happen either way stop waiting stop waiting and start manifesting can we, the Gemini's please have an affirmation to go with manifesting and forgiveness gosh <laughs> so okay so two more bonus cards look at you with your bonus cards Gemini extra special maybe uh, they are two for each of your twins okay so strength and spontaneous okay so you're hereby declared the strong resilient 
warrior with heroic proportions. Enjoy your battles, whatever they are, because you are guaranteed to come through them stronger, brighter, and more compassionate. And do you like spontaneous adventures of the highest caliber? The only acceptable answer to this question is yes. So buckle up. You're about to take a wild ride through the unexplored, unconventional, and underrated. You're about to learn that yes is a magic word with the power to unlock a new dimension of space, time, and after hour hangouts. Yes will lead you to experiences that you didn't think possible and teach you that a lifelong friendships are something lurking behind the karyo karaoke singer's mullet. That's hilarious. These are so funny. But here, finally, Gemini, your affirmation, and I will type this in the description box below. Okay, so the story of my life. As I tell myself the story of what's happening in my life, I choose to make it the kind of story that even though the par tough parts have an inner sort of beauty, it's ultimately a happy story where every character, no matter how wicked, is doing their best. And let me tell you, it'll be worth it. Wow, Gemini, those are amazing. Okay, let's see. with one card holy moly okay judgment so the steps you've already taken is leading you to your current place the key like the the bunny has the key like oh my gosh you are definitely so definitely be telling the the story you want to play out because you have judgment okay wow holy shit Gemini, that is incredible. Holy shit. Ten of Cups, bottom of the deck, okay? This is future friends, family, loyalty. This is, um, yeah, get creative with your time, okay? Uh, loving hearts. The tower, holy shit. Okay, so you definitely got some good, good, good changes coming, Gemini. Good changes. Work on that forgiveness and uh, make sure you're telling your, the story of your life of how you. Wow, you guys, this is amazing. Let's see what badass rebel card for the Gemini's. Badass rebel card for the Gemini's. Please, badass card for the Gemini's. Let's see what kind of badass card we can get. Okay, for the Gemini's. forgiveness okay <laughs> fuck them with forgiveness because everything is coming together as soon as you do that you're gonna have a tower moment okay don't don't um, hold on to don't have a stronghold of stuff if it's trying to leave because you're making way for the for this this is this is reciprocal this is healthy love. This is healthy love, you guys. Wow! Yay! Awesome! Okay, thank you so much for being here, Geminis. I'm gonna try and get a timestamp. So... Ready? Okay. Next, we're gonna do Libra.
were kind of Are you ready for this? Your affirmation is love. Woo! Okay, so love is a many splendid thing. Today, I will choose to notice and appreciate at least three of those splendors. Like the, pa the fact that puppies make you feel like a parent or the surge of self-congratulations when I sink a three-point trash basket shot on the first try or how about the chills I get when I'm singing along to my favorite song okay those that's a great affirmation you guys be very beautiful is there any other affirmation that the Libras need for when they find this message Libras this is a timeless message when you find it when you're supposed to be here I've asked for you to be here to find this when you needed it Okay, so we've got a couple more. Let's see what these are. Yes! Oh my gosh, Libra, get ready, okay? Because you also, like the Gemini, had the spontaneous and manifestation, okay? These are bonus cards. It says, if you could have anything you wanted, what would it be? Get Pacific and get greedy. You are holding the magic wand and you can courage up anything. It could be that you declare your wishes out loud that you're actually casting spells for your dreams to come true or is it that it's just a very practical sense and the more people you speak about your desires the more folks know that know what you want and might be able to have the means to help you make them happen either way stop waiting and start manifesting and do you like spontaneous adventures of the highest caliber the only acceptable answer to this question is yes. So buckle up. You're about to take a wild ride through the unexplored, unconventional, unrated. You are about to learn that yes is the magic word with the power to unlock new dimensions in space, time, and after hour hangouts. Yes will lead you to experiences that you didn't think possible and teach you that lifelong friendships are sometimes lurking just behind the karaoke singer's mullet with engagement okay so this is this affirmation is today and i will type these out and put them in the job box for you so you can see them say them to yourself today i make a conscious choice to engage in the world in an active way i will take a new route and i'll talk to strangers i will smell some flowers i'll pet dogs and maybe i'll walk around barefoot for a while if I'm not inside the 7-Eleven, at the very least, I'll have a slightly more interesting than average day. And at the most, I'll have a startling epiphany or make a friend who will change my life forever with no pressure. Woo! <laughs> Libras, you got a busy night <laughs> or a busy, busy day whenever you find this. Okay, so the Libras need some beautiful guidance from this amazing deck. When they find this message, when they find this message, okay, Libras, 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 okay, Libras, ah, oh, yes, okay, so give love to receive love. This is the, the, um, the Empress, okay, she, she knows that all is connected. Okay, let's see what's Okay, so this is, um, oh wow, because I was getting ready to say, um, this would be like fertility, pregnancy, marriage, like news of those. And then I pulled the, the queen of pentacles. This is like a mother, a wealthy motherly energy, okay? Um, or maybe, share love with Capricorn type energy. So the Queen of uh, Pentacles is definitely Capricorn energy. Motherly energy, wealth. Let's see what else. Anything else for the Libras to go with the Empress and the Queen of Death, please? Thank you, thank you. Nice. 
Nice. We got another three. So double threes, Libra. Three, three, if that means anything to you. Okay, so the three of cups is all about celebration. And the king of pentacles. This is about, this, this is like a Virgo energy, but this is like going at something with a practical mind instead of your emotional, um, emotional guidance. Let's see. Bottom of the deck. So hanged man. So suspend the disbelief and look at it from a different perspective. Okay. There's something going on. There's like some isolation. The four of cups is also about like petty desires. Learning about energy work um, with the knave of wands. Okay. So recognize the energy you're putting out so you can, you know, make sure that's what you want to receive. The five of wands, this is a harmless test of integrity, okay? Harmless test of integrity. <laughs> Did it, your manifestation told you you had the magic wand. You have the magician card. Libras, okay, you definitely need to tap into um, the magic that's within you. Maybe that's what you could be doing in this isolation. Because that, that, um, we're all isolated right now, you know? Let's see what the... Ah, definitely Capricorn energy and the Libra, um, and the Libra mix, okay? You got two Cap... Two Capricorn energies. This devil card is um, not scary. It's not supposed to be scary at all. This is more like letting you know, like maybe you have some attachments, um, like something could be draining you, something could be stopping your your magic ability because she's she's uh, the one's got leopard and the other one is drained of all her collar okay so I don't know if that you have a Capricorn in your life let's see what badass rebel card they can bless us with for the Libras for the Libras for badass rebel advice for the Libras checking on that person just fucking stop spend time spend your time on someone worth it don't wait it it on ridiculousness okay step away from the crazy making diet for a hot second kill tastes like shit eat some yummy shit like bacon chocolate and beer get you some okay maybe they're telling you this definitely okay so spend your time on somebody worth it if somebody's draining you that's the time to release it if it's a Capricorn or not it doesn't have to be it's just there's something draining your energy <laughs> they're telling you go eat go eat there's love here okay you're gonna have to spontaneously say yes amazing you guys holy shit yeah I'm so grateful that you're here these are repeating numbers of threes so that's also manifesting numbers 33 they also count three four five if that means anything to anybody Wow, you guys, this is amazing, amazing, amazing. <laughs> All right, next we're gonna do Aquarius.
what kind of so, hi Aquariuses, thank you so much for being here with me. We are um, gonna pull some cards. This is a timeless video. So when you find it, it's when you were supposed to. I have asked to um, give you some guidance from these beautiful decks. So here we go Aquarius. Beautiful affirmations. Aquarius need for the collective back to one from this amazing affirmation deck. Is a beautiful affirmation for the Aquarius for when I find this video. The collective two one. Woo! Oh my gosh, you guys. Okay, so you got quite a few. someone starts speaking unkindly to me I'll remember that they've got something going on that has nothing to do with me like maybe they just pooped their pants yes it is possible engagement is your second one today I take a conscious choice to engage in the world in an active way I'll take a new route I'll talk to strangers I will smell the flowers pet dogs and maybe walk around barefoot for a while uh, I'll at the very least, I'll have a slightly more interesting than average day, and at the most, I'll have a starting epiphany or make a friend who will change my life forever. No pressure. Okay, um, euthanicity. Okay, so I'm gonna make sure you go to the Dropbox where these will be typed out so you can say them to yourself. Um, euthanicity, okay, is euthanicity is the name of the game. Whatever comes up, I will fill it. Whatever needs to be said, I will say it. Whoever doesn't get it doesn't have to, but at least that they know it because I've said it. And that's way better than leaving a passive aggressive note about it, okay? So I feel like this was only take what resonates with you because this is a collective and we did receive so many of them. Okay, and these guys come out together. So generosity. I give generously to those around me no matter how much or how little I have. I know that there are more than enough to go around and the key is to allow it to keep going around without stopping. If I stop the flow, I'm like the one person at the stadium who doesn't stand to do the wave. Love! Okay, so love is a many splendid thing. Today I will notice and appreciate at least three of those splendors. Like the fact that puppies make me feel like a parent or the surge of self-congratulations when I sink a three-point trash basket shot on the first try. Or how about the chills I get when I'm singing along to your favorite song? Power! This is amazing, Aquarius. I am strong, I am grounded, I am powerful. I'm like a cross between a dinosaur and a tank, but not a tank used for war. I'm a peaceful, loving dino tank who feels so strong it doesn't need to be anything but be. 